Hey guys, what's up? I'm Rohit Khanna, host on Click Digest. And the very reason I bought a Nexus device was for the latest updates from Google. I'm using a Google Nexus 6, and after a long wait, the update for 5.1, which is the latest firmware, when I'm making this video, is finally out. And I've just got this notification which says Android 5.1 system update is available. The update size is 400 and 10 MB. If you don't have an update notification as yet, I would suggest you to go to settings. In settings, just go to about phone, which is right at the bottom, and check for system updates, which is right on top. You may or may not have received this update already because these updates are rolled out in batches, and I also got it pretty late. So if you have not got it, make sure you check it like once a day, and I'm sure you will soon get it if you have not got it till now. To download and install this update, just hit download and wait for some time until this download finishes. The download time will depend on how fast your internet connection is. I would suggest that you use your Wi-Fi, which is usually faster and cheaper, to download this update. The update has been downloaded and been verified by the phone, and now you just need to hit the restart and install button at the bottom of the screen. After which, the installation process will start. This will make your phone to turn off for a few minutes, and it will come up on its own. And this boot will take longer time than the usual boots. So stand by and wait for it to restart. And here we are after the reboot, and the update has been effective now. Let me show you the software version that it is running after the update. So you can see that it is now running on Android 5.1, which is the latest version. This tutorial is applicable for almost every Nexus phone out there, or Nexus device like Nexus 7 tablets as well. And you can follow this tutorial for even the later versions. The procedure remains the same. You have to go to Settings, About Phone, System Updates, and you will always get the latest updates listed here. Sometimes it may take longer. For certain devices to get the update, but eventually you will get it if you are on an Nexus device. This is all we have on this tutorial. We hope you enjoyed watching it and found this useful. If you did, don't forget to give us a thumbs up by pressing the like button below. And for more such videos, make sure to hit that red subscribe button. This is your host Rohit Khurana signing off. Thanks for watching.